because it's been over a year since I've gotten a pair of heels. Yeah, it's been over a year since I purchased a pair of heels because I don't, no, oh, no, I lied. The last heels I got were the YSL one. So I was excited to get some new shoes, shoes that looks like it'd be easier to walk in, but I'm not exactly sure. So we're gonna find out. But anyway, so I was scrolling my Instagram and I, I've been knowing about Ego Shoes or Ego Official and i was like hmm, let me see and they just happened to be having like a 50 percent off sale so i was like okay i have to go ahead and get this while they are on sale so this is gonna be a really quick haul i only bought three pairs of shoes um my total came to like 92 dollars each shoe one shoe was 29 and the other two no two pairs were 29 and then one was 22. So let's just go get in. Okay, I can't even talk. Like, what is going on with me and my videos lately? But let's go ahead and get into the first pair of shoes. All right, so the first pair of shoes is really out of my comfort zone, you guys. Extremely out of my comfort zone. So, but I've been loving seeing these all over Instagram and a lot of Instagram bloggers and stuff wear these shoes. And I've never been the type to like any type of mule shoe, but I just thought these were cute and they looked really comfortable. And they're also a dupe to the Bottega, Bottega Veneta, Veneta shoe that is really popular right now. So let me go ahead and show you. So bam, this is what the shoe looks like. I'll make sure to show you guys what they look like on my actual feet. But this is what they look like, you guys. They are so cute. Now I got this in the color nude, but it kind of looks like a nude slash pink. I'm getting like pinky vibes. Um, I also like that the heel is really small, so it should be easy to walk in. Um, this part that goes across the top of your foot is extremely comfortable. Um, my foot fits in it perfectly. It looks like it'll be a really cute shoe, a cute and comfortable shoe. And I like how Ego shoes, like they kind of have like some padding built into the sole of their heels. So it looks like it's going to be extremely comfortable, which is great because I love a comfortable heel. So it looks like it might be a shoe that I can wear for a few hours. So I haven't worn them yet. And I've been really liking the new square toe trend that's been going on. Mostly because I have crooked toes, okay? Like my big toe is crooked. Um, it's been crooked like all my life and I really don't know why it's crooked. So uh, I feel like a square toe kind of like give my foot a little bit more room. And I just, I just like the whole aesthetic of the square toe vibe or the square toe trend that's going on right now. So these, again, these were $29.99 and this says it's a nude faux leather. I wear size 10, which is equal to a 41 in Euro um, and an eight in UK sizing, which is, this brand is UK based. And this shoe also has some grip on the bottom, so that I like as well. So that is the first pair. The second pair of shoes that I got you guys, I, I am absolutely in love with these as well. I wanted a good everyday black heel, something that I could wear with pretty much anything that is comfortable. So I got these, bam. Let me just show you guys so you guys can see the heel. So the heel is a square. Well, the heel is, I don't know what shape you would call this really, but it's not just a straight up and down heel, which is why I got these because I'm like, look at all this space that you have to walk. It's kind of like wearing a chunky heel, but the heel isn't chunky because it gets skinny and then it opens up at the bottom. So I really thought that that was cute. And this also has the square heel or the square toe that I'm really loving right now. And it looks really good when you have your feet freshly done. And I also like the strap detail with this shoe. So, you know, it goes around your ankle and it also has the little part for your your big toe is separated from the rest of your toes in this shoe. So I just think it is so cute. This shoe is the Freestyle Square Toe Pyramid Heel. Okay, Pyramid, there we go. Pyramid Heel and Black Faux Leather. 
and I just thought this was so cute. I'm like, I'm gonna be able to wear this everywhere I go because the heel is thick. It looks extremely comfortable. Like I said, it has cushion in the sole of a shoe, so it really looks like you're gonna be able to wear this shoe for hours. I'm gonna test it one day on my next date night, whenever that'll be, because with this COVID stuff going on, it's just really, really hard to make date night plans. But I just think the shoe is so cute. What do you guys think? All right, you guys, so we are going on to the last pair. I told you all this haul was gonna be really quick. So this one here, oh, I just lost it, okay. Oh, okay. So this one here is called the True Square Toe Lace Up Clear Per Spex Heel in White Full Leather. This shoe was $29.99. It's literally just like the black heel that I just showed you guys, except it comes with this extra string that you can tie up your leg. I don't know exactly if I'm gonna tie it up my leg or not, um, I was trying to see if there was a way to take this out, but it's not. Um, there's no way to undo the straps or take the straps out. So you'd have to do that or just tie it around your ankle. But this heel is clear on the back. You guys can see the heel. And it's a really skinny heel. So I love the square detailing, as I've said in all, which is the reason why I got these three, these three because I like the square toe. Um, and I also just liked the fact that this tied up my leg. And with this heel though, it's a little skinty, so this might be a little difficult to walk in. We'll see when I wear it, but I love the detail of the shoe. I have a white shoe that has, that ties up around the leg, so it's, it's kind of funny that I end up with another white shoe that ties up around the leg. But like I said, mainly I got this because of the square toe, but I did plan on getting a white shoe just like the black shoe, but at the time it was only pre-order. And I was like, I don't want to wait for a pre-order. I just want to get the shoe. So I found another one like that. And it has the cute strap detail going on. So um, I don't know. We'll see. Hopefully this isn't hard to walk in. If it is, this is definitely not be a shoe that I will be grabbing that often. But I really wanted to get a comfortable nude shoe and a comfortable black shoe because I like wearing nude and black shoes. I mean, they go with everything. But it's also nice to have a white shoe that you can, like if you have on a white top or something, um, so I, I wanted to get a white shoe that I can use whenever I want to, you know, wear white. But I think I might specifically save this for when I wear dresses because the fact that it ties up your leg, you want to be able to, you want to be in shorts or you want to be in a dress when you wear a shoe like this because otherwise it'll be bunched up at the bottom um, of your jeans. Or you can tie it up your jeans. I mean, whichever creative way you would decide to wear them, that is up to you. So that is it for this shoe haul, you guys. Like I told y'all, it was gonna be really quick. I only got three pairs. I could have gotten more, but I'm just like, no. You know, I'm just trying to, I just needed to get some basic pieces in my collection. Cause I have a new shoe and I have black shoes with the clear heel that you guys have seen millions of times, but I've had those shoes for like three years now. Um, and I wanted to get some shoes with the square toe because those are trending right now. So I just really wanted to kind of like step up my fashion. So if you guys like this video, I hope you guys thumbs up and subscribe. And don't forget to follow me on my Instagram, which is jerica.sincere. You can follow me on there for beauty and fashion looks. And also comment down below which shoe is your favorite, the nude shoe, the black shoe, or the white shoe. But thank you guys so much for watching and have a good day.